Ladies and gentlemen, your Princess Thunder. Digging in, Luke Tendler. He'll get us started in this one under the lights. He took something off of it there. It's one and two. Ooh, that's a good pitch to take a hack at right there. Change up up of the zone. Eh, he'd like to have that one back. Set to deal on a ball and two strikes. Swung on and missed. Really fooled him that time for the first out. Digging in. Jeter Downs. As he'll get his first opportunity in this one. Down. No offer on that one. Two balls and a strike. Bounce to first. Field it cleanly. Throw in time at first for out number two. To the plate now is the designated hitter, Sandy Donald. First chance for the top of the first with nobody on. From the windup, the 1 1 pitch. And he misses 2 and 1. Ball three. Tristan Casas would be next if they can keep this inning alive. And we'll have the first base runner of the ball game here as that misses, and it's a two out walk. Now in the box, Tristan Casas. And he's a guy looking to break out in a big way. Hasn't been getting the results he or his club have been hoping for. And he'll dive back in safely. One one. That's lifted the other way out to left. And as it turns out, the two out walk doesn't come around to haunt him as that ends the inning. Striding in, Kyle Holder. He'll lead things off here in the bottom half of the first. lifted down the line in left and this will wind up a foul ball the one two in the air out to left Tendler is there and he makes the catch for the out next will be the designated hitter Everson Pereira he'll get to take his first cuts here the two two he takes strike three called on the fastball. Couldn't pull the trigger, and there are two away. Batting third. The so striding baseman. forward now, Coy Park. First cuts Four. for him here with the bases open and two away. And there's ball two now. And he can't catch the corner here, so he's behind three and one. Hitters count all the way. Here it comes. Now a swing, and he gets him to pop it up. In there, a base hit. Not in time, and he's in there with a double. Batting four. The right fielder, Isaiah Gilliam. Standing in now, Isaiah Gilliam. And that's low, so a good eye there as he works the count back full. And it's belted high and deep into right center. Racing back to center fielder the track and a leaping effort at the wall but it's in vain a home run into the box Chris Gittens and he lays off a pitch outside as they draw even at two and two did a good job to shorten up and protect the plate and he'll have another shot at it here Swing and a liner. Foul. Making him sweat out there. The seventh pitch coming up. Swung on, and he went fishing in the dirt. Rye recovers, and the throw to first ends the inning.
into the box now. Chad DeLaguerra. He did not play last night, but clearly back in the starting nine for this one. To two balls and two strikes now. This is hit the other way out toward left field. Left fielder is on the move. He gets there and makes the play for the first out. Stepping in, Jaron Duran. The right fielder, Jaron Duran. Rounded back up the middle, reined in. And an off balance throw is in time as he takes one away. Wow. So striding in, Austin Wright. He drove in one of their two runs in last night's ball game. Hits this one hard the other way. He's right there, and he'll step on the bag himself, and the inning is over. Ready to go for the last half of the inning, and that'll give way to the third baseman, Angel Aguilar. One of the keys to securing a win, they want to keep the pressure on and try to build that lead as much as they can moving into the later innings. Two and one to count. Softly on a line to third. And that's out number one. Set to get his evening at the plate started. Max Burt batting just a notch below 300 so far on the season. There's ball two as the slider dips below the zone. Two and two. Bases are empty, one man out. Hit out towards second. And that is through into center field for a one out single. Batting it. The left fielder. Esteban. At the plate now. Esteban Pacheco. Now a swing and he gets him to pop it up. Downs. Backs up and takes care of it. Two away. So stepping in, Frankie Diaz. He takes his first cuts in this one with a man at first and two away. He's set. Here comes the 1-1. Swing and a miss on the fastball, and it's one and two. Misses, ball two. Man, 35 pitches with only two outs in the second inning? Ideally, you'd like to have 30 or less after two innings, so he's got some catching up to do. And that's taken high for a ball that's full now, three and two. Lifted into center field. Hardy is under it, and he makes the catch for out number three. Coming to the plate now, Dylan Hardy. And he's a guy looking to break out in a big way. Hasn't been getting the results he or his club have been hoping for. Way outside, nearly to the backstop, two and one. And he misses low here, so the count goes to three and one. You do not want to walk the eight hole hitter. It just opens up so many options. Do we bunt him over to second with the nine-hole hitter? Do we try and play for that big rally with the top of the order coming up? This is a huge pitch. Oh, well, that's well hit. Deep center field. A ball that's carrying. On the warning track, he makes the catch. Now at the plate, Michael Osinski comes off an 0 for 4 in last night's ball game. The 2-2. Hit in the air to right field. Gilliam is there. Two down. Stepping in and ready for another shot. Luke Tendler. He was a strikeout victim to open up the ball game. Trying to send him packing for the second time. And this one runs in on him as he can't get his arms extended. A great pitch there and the inning is over. To play Kyle Holder. 0 for 1 here in the early going. Now the 1 and 1 pitch. 
taken. Strike two. Count one and two. Had to sit back on the changeup, and he did a good job to get the bat on that one. The next one, two pitch. And he goes and chops this one out towards second. And a good throw gets him one gone. Striding in once again, Everson Pereira. He got called out on strikes his last time through. Yeah, Matty, and he was locked up by a good fastball for strike three last time. I'm interested to see if they attack him the same way. Come at him with hard velo late or snap something off in the dirt to see if they'll fish. And they're working the outer half here, but that one's wide for ball three. Ground ball sent back up the middle and into center field as he's aboard with a one out single. Now back, second baseman. Into the box now, Hoy Park. Filthy change up that time, but he's able to make contact and he'll get another chance. Payoff pitch one more time. And he misses with that one for ball four. So that'll put runners on first and second now with one away. Digging in the switch hitter, Isaiah Gilliam. He's set. Here comes the 1-1. One, one. A time to start making some quality pitches. He finds himself in a tough spot behind an account with guys on base. And it's two balls and two strikes now. Two balls, two strikes. And he misses this one inside, and that'll run things full three and two. For the guy on the mound, this is one of those innings where nothing comes easy. He's thrown a bunch of pitches, and this A.B. hasn't been any different. Definitely laboring at the moment. Hold high in the air out to right field. Duran is over just a few steps to his left as he takes it for out number two. Digging in to try it again, Chris Gittins. He was a strikeout victim in his first try. Yeah, but it was a good changeup, Matty. Good arm action on that pitch. Look for him to try and stay back a little bit more. Let the ball get a little deeper. Don't be shocked if this pitcher tries to rush a heater right here. Tough pitch to lay off there, but he did, and it's even up at two and two. Rounded down the third baseline. He's got it. And the two-out threat will not come to pass as the inning is over. In now, Jeter Downs as we begin the top of the fourth. And he lays off there, ball four. So the leadoff man is on here to begin stands at number four. The batter, now with the plate, Sandy Donald. He drew a walk Sandy his first time up. Donald. Hit hard to the right side. That's a base hit. Their first of the game. And some trouble now in right field. Now that third baseman, Christian Crawford. Stepping in now, Tristan Casas. Taken high and deep to right. Looking up is the right fielder. Still ranging back. And this one is gone. A home run. So now to the plate, Chad De La Guerra. This is on the ground over to first. And he'll take it to the bag himself for the out. Stepping up to the plate, Jaron Duran. He got on top of one and was a ground out victim Durant. last time. 1-1. One, one. This is in the air out to straightaway center. Center fielder on the run. He gets there, and that's the second out. Sliding into the box, Austin Wright. He's 0 for 1 after grounding out in his only trip to the plate so far. Close there, but he doesn't get the call with the breaking ball. Dylan Hardy would be next if they can keep this inning alive. Swing and a liner. A leaping try, but it's out of his reach and into the outfield. The throw into second. 
And a good effort to bring it back in quickly, but he's in at second base with a double. Now batting the center fielder, Dylan Hardy. At the plate, Dylan Hardy. Now a ball lined to the left side, but foul. Here's the one two skied in the air to straightaway left. Pacheco will get there and he puts it away to retire the side. Leading off the inning Angel Aguilar as they'll look to get something going here and even this game up. Ball two. And a slider's in the dirt as he lays off it for a ball. That pitch was way down on two and two, but give the hitter some credit there. Sometimes with two strikes, you're more off to expand the strike zone, but he didn't and held off on that one that wasn't even close. So he racks up the swinging strikeout on the breaking ball. Angel Aguilar is dealt with for the first out in the bottom of the inning. A ball and two strikes now. Fly ball out to straightaway right. Duran will drift over to his left a few steps as he takes it for the second out. Now at the plate, Esteban Pacheco over one for him here in this one. Down low, two balls and a strike. Two one pitches, a fastball off the plate away, and it's three and one now. Hitters count all the way. Here it comes. Change up too low. He walked him. Standing in, Frankie now Diaz. Back. He flew out Look in his last at bat. The 2 2. Popped him up. Osinski will range over to make the catch just beyond the first base dugout, and that will end the inning. Ball set for the start of the inning, and next to bat will be the first baseman, Michael Osinski. Here's the one and one delivery. And he looks at one in there, one and two. And he'll lay off the curveball that's in the dirt that time, and it's back to even now at two and two. And good patience to hold back on the curveball in the dirt. It's full now, three and two. Having a hard time putting this hitter away here. And when I was looking at the tape on him from his last start, this is what I saw a lot of. He's not closing the door on guys. And, and when that's the case, they eventually get a pitch that they can do something with. Number 10. So the lineup flips over and digging in, Luke Tendler. He struck out swinging in his last trip to the plate. And this is low, ball two, two and one couple strikeouts early in the game but he's done a much better job in this at bat trying to get ahead and put himself in a good hitters count Holder ranges back and he has it for out number two coming to the plate now, now Jeter Downs Jeter Downs well hit the other way and it's into the gap Legs churning. He's headed for second. And now he'll get into scoring position with two away. The battle number two. Designated hitter. Sandy. In now, Donald. Sandy Donald. Called strike, and he's behind one and two. Can't say he's tickling around the zone. Those last two pitches were pretty much grooved right down the middle, but it didn't bite him. Hit on the ground to third. Scooped up, and nothing will come with a two-out double as the inning is over. Standing in, Kyle Holder. He's 0 for 2 in the ballgame so far. No offer on that one. Two balls and a strike. 
Nope. He's fallen behind now, three and one. Down by a run, your guy needs to get on any way he can. His mentality has to be to shrink the strike zone to like the size of a soup can. No reason to swing at a pitcher's now pitch. The designated hitter at the plate, Everson Pereira. He's one for two in this one. Now the one and one pitch. And they pitch out here, but nothing's going on. Holder aboard here at first with nobody out. Hard hit ball to second. He leaps, but he can't get it. It's down for extra bases. And they've really got something going here. Runners at second and third to start the inning. Now that is the second base heavy. Standing in now, Hoy Park. Now a swing and a miss, and he's behind one and two. And a changeup swung on and missed for the first down. Now with the plate, Isaiah Gilliam, as he's got a chance to tie this ball game up with that equalizing run just 90 feet away at third. The set and the 1 1 pitch. Lofted in the air out toward right center. Catch made here in medium deep right center and the runners breaking from third. Top of the throw will be well up the line as he scores easily. Stepping into the box, Chris Gittins. He was retired via the ground ball last time up. The 2 2. A bouncer up the middle. Reined in. And the off balance throw gets him as he takes away a hit and the side is retired. Digging in, Tristan Casas. He had that big three run homer in his last appearance. It'll be interesting to see if they use that changeup in this at bat. That last at bat, that was a changeup he hit for a home run. I'm going to see if this time they don't go to more fastballs and curveballs. High in the air out towards shallow right. Park retreats to the outfield grass and he has it for round number one. So digging in now, Chad DeLaguerra, 0 for 2 with a fly ball and a ground out on his line to this point. Just a bit high with the fastball, but didn't get the call. And now a pitch hit sharply on the ground. But a foul ball, and it's full now at 3 and 2. And here's a changeup in there for a called third strike, and that's the second out of the inning. Now batting. The now batting, Jaron Duran. Yeah. He's bounced out and Durant. flown out in his first two plate appearances. Hard liner to center field. Bird is going to have room out there as he puts this away to retire the side. Brian Mata enters to do the pitching in the bottom of the sixth. Number 90, Brian Mata. Settling in now, Angel Aguilar. 0 for 2 for him to this point. The 1 1 home is an off speed pitch taken for a ball. And that's ball three now as it just misses below the zone. The 3 1. Smoke on the ground up the middle. And that's a base hit, so the pressure's on to open up the inning. Now that the center fielder. At the plate now, Max Burt got him. Fooled on the pitch as he swings at it in the dirt for strike three. Now Stepping into the box, Esteban Pacheco will swing it from the left side right here. This is somewhat of a cause for concern. This guy needs to hit better left-handed against right-handed pitching. Scorched to third. 
fielded cleanly. There's one on to first as they get the double play to get him out of the inning. Braden Bristow is on to pitch from the bullpen now to start inning number seven. Number eight. Boy there. Into the box, Austin Wright. He doubled his last time through. And he's got to build off that last A.B. He battled. Usually when you battle, you get in that swing mode. A lot of pitches, you'll swing at the rosin bag. I love the fact that he was able to work a double in last at bat. Let's see if we get more of the same right here. Here's the 2-1. Every base runner in a close game like this really matters. So you can't afford to be giving out free passes this late. And he lays off ball four. Now the potential go ahead run is on base here. Now that ready for another chance. Dylan Hardy third trip to the plate for him here tonight. 0 for 2 at this point. The 2 1. Got to find a way to get back in his zone. I know you're in danger of losing both to walks. But certainly don't miss over the heart of the plate and have this guy gap one, or even worse, hit a two-run home. And he misses with it, ball four. Now so the potential go-ahead run three. moves into scoring Michael. position now. Oh, the 3-2 pitch. Hit in the air out to straightaway left. Pacheco has him played perfectly as he puts it away for round number one. So the batting order turns over now and set to go Luke Tendler. He's hitless in three at-bats to this point. The 2-1 home. Here's a line drive, and this game may not stay tied for long. That's down for extra bases. One run will score easily. Here's the second runner around third. And he's safe at the plate. And it's now 5-3. Caleb Ward comes on to pitch here with one now man gone in the top of the seventh. Peter to the plate now. Jeter downs. One and two now. That's just too much velocity upstairs to get good wood on it. It's going to have to lower his sights. Still one and two as he fouls it away. Lofted in the air out toward right center. Gilliam is over to his right as he puts this one away. Two down. Digging in now. Sandy Donald. Runner in scoring position with two gone. Sandy Donald. And the pitch on two and one. But a good play by the first baseman to spear this one and that'll retire the side. Stepping in, Frankie Diaz. His last at bat didn't go his way as he popped out in foul territory. Yeah, Matt, he's got to make an adjustment right here. His swing definitely broke down, dropped his back shoulder, and thus the result was a terrible pop up foul. And good patience to hold back on the curveball in the dirt. It's full now, three and two. And in a two run game right here, you really don't want to walk the leadoff guy to start an inning. You've got to keep that tying run in the on deck circle as long as you can. And that misses ball four. It's a leadoff walk to start the home seventh. Ready for another shot now. Kyle Holder, 0 for 2 from him so far in this one. Now the one and one pitch. Waves and misses for strike number two. Low and inside with the breaking ball as that causes him to back up a bit. He's set. Here's the 2 2. Oh, on the ground is short. Could this be two? One there on to first. And that's the very last thing they needed at this point in the ball game as there are quickly two away now. So base is empty now after the double play. And standing in is the DH, Everson Pereira. 
a swing and a shot hit down the corner. And he just couldn't keep that ball fair as it winds up a long foul ball. Well hit to right, but foul. Bases are empty here with two men out. Strike three called as he can't get the bat off his shoulder. Side retired. Trevor Lane has been summoned from the bullpen as he'll do so to start the eighth. Number 10. Rubber. New inning set to get underway and set to go as the third baseman, Tristan Casas. Hit hard towards the hole. And a reach to his backhand, but he can't come up with it, and the leadoff man's aboard. Now batting. The puppet baseball. Stepping in yeah. now, Chad de la Guerra. De la Runner Guerra. goes per second. High fly ball out to straightaway center. And he will make the catch while ranging backward as he just put the glove up and hauled it in for the first out. Now that is so coming to the right plate, field. Jaron Duran. Jerry. He could really use a knock Durant. here 0 for 3 in the game so far. Swing and a drive to right. There it goes. Into the second deck and gone. Into the box now, Austin Ryan. Slider is in there, and now it's one and two. And he lays off a pitch outside as they draw even at two and two. Hot shot on the ground is short. Scooped up. And there's out number two. Ready once again, Dylan Hardy. No hits to this point. Two out, nobody on. Ball and two strikes now. Now that's popped up. Gittens is there to make the catch, and the side is retired. Digging in once again, Hoy Park. He looked to bounce back after striking out his last time up. And you can live with punching out with the bases empty, but in his last at bat with two runners in scoring position, you cannot go down not putting the ball in play. Too much on the line, too many ribby opportunities out there to swing and miss in that spot. So here's the cleanup hitter, Isaiah Gilliam, earned himself an RBI with a sack fly his last time at the plate. Took him right up the ladder that time, and it's one and two. With the way this guy's throwing on the mound, you cannot be chasing. You have to set your sights a little bit lower and control the strike zone. Oh, and you can tell he wanted to hold off, but he swings through the inside pitch anyway, and he becomes out number two. And this is taken here for ball four. Just the second walk he's allowed into his eighth inning of work. The third base Stepping up now, Angel Aguilar. He's working on a one for three thus far. Here now the 2-2 is laid off and the count runs full. Good spot for an RBI. Put the ball in play with the runner in motion. He could score all the way from first. This is line to left. And eight innings have come and gone now as the inning is over. Will Carter enters from the pen to start the ninth inning as he'll try to keep the score right where it is heading to the bottom of the ninth. All set to start the ninth in this one. And here comes the first baseman, Michael Osinski. A 1-1. This is skied into short left center. Here comes a left fielder. He gets to it and makes the catch for the first out. Trying to pick things up where we left off. Luke Tendler. Tendler. The one two. He is offered at and missed. He chased it for strike three. 
into the box now. Jeter Downs. It was a flyout for him in his last trip. Now the one and one pitch. And it's fouled away. The one two. Nasty breaking ball swung on in the dirt. Diaz has it. The throw to first is in time and the inning is over. Plate, Max Bird. The 1-1. One, one. Pretty well struck high and deep to left field. Left fielder looking up to the track to the wall. And that one is gone. Sad Ward takes the ball now in inning number nine, looking to close the door. Number 14. Sad Ward. So now to the plate, Esteban Pacheco, and he misses ball four. So he comes out of the bullpen and immediately walks the first man he faces. Ready now, Frankie Diaz. 0 for 2 with a walk for him so far. He's set. Here comes the 1 1. Heading out towards shallow right. Right fielder is on the run. Oh, and a great diving catch for the first down. Now to the plate, Kyle Holder. He was a double play victim last time around. Yeah, and another double play right here would certainly end this game. Let's see if they pitch him the same way. Hard in, soft away. Now he gets the ground ball to first. This might be two to second for one. On to first, and he rolls a double play ball to end it here as this ball game is over. Well, baseball is a game of streaks and runs, so a four-game skid happens to even the best of teams. The key is they didn't panic or press. They just came out here, played their game, and put the losing streak behind them like professionals are supposed to do. Well done. 7-4 to four is the final score in tonight's game. The Sea Dogs jumped ahead in the seventh inning and never gave the lead back. Brian Mata earns the victory out of the bullpen his fifth. Thad Ward wraps it up for the save, his 16th of the season. So that's a wrap for us here tonight. For my partners in the booth, Mark DeRosa and Dan Plezak, and our entire crew, I'm Matt Vaskersian. You've been watching MLB The Show. And for more, click over to theshownation.com. Our final line score, first for the victorious Sea Dogs, seven runs, seven hits, no errors, they left four men on base. For the Thunder, four runs, seven hits, one error, they left eight runners on base. Time of the ball game, three hours and 33 minutes. Thank you for joining us here tonight. And we remind you to please drive home safely.